Okay, so in this video, I'm gonna show you the best process lasso settings you need to follow on your PC in order to get maximum performance out of your any PC in any game in 2024. This software will help you to optimizing your CPU for having the better performance on your overall PC. So guys, make sure to follow this whole video and without wasting any time, let's dive straight into our this video. So guys, before going toward our main optimization of the process lasso, it is always recommended to delete all the junk data from your PC. Before that, go for your Windows search search for temporary and you will find that delete temporary files in your system settings open up the system settings and there you will find that all installed apps documents video other file and here is the temporary files and that is around 27 gb of the temporary data so open up your temporary data inside you will find out your downloads if any important file is available in the download so guys simply uncheck this box then here is the windows update cleanup check mark here device driver cleanup check mark here thumbnail also check mark on this box delete temporary internet file also check mark here temporary app files also check mark here microsoft defender antivirus also check mark here delivery optimization check mark on this box system error mini dump file check mark here and at the end here is direct text shader cache also check mark here you can read here all this instruction like how this will help you improving your fps and your overall pc performance and responsiveness so guys let's just select all these sections from here now you will find out here your total uh, stacked data that is around 14 gb of the data so click on the remove file button click continue and this will start deleting all this temporary file out of your pc so guys now the next step first of all for downloading the process lesson on your pc simply open up or join my discord server go for download tab and there you will find our downloading for the process lesson so to download on your PC, simply right click here, click on the open button and install this application on your PC. So first of all, click OK, click I agree, click next and install Process Lasso on your PC. So guys, here is the interface of the Process Lasso and now I'm going to show you all the important settings you need to follow inside this application. Right, this is the same exactly like the task manager of your Windows, but this is in advanced mode. So guys in the very first step go for this main option and, and check mark on manage processes for all the users after that now go for active power profile option and set it on with some highest performance because this is the best power plan for your pc for gaming after that here you will find that pro balance enable mode by default it is turned on i suggest you to turn it off and simply go for performance mode enable and check mark on this option and this will enable it on your pc now in the next step you need to launch your, your specific game in which you want to improve your pc performance or your fps so guys here i have run the fortnite in my background and now you need to go for this active processes option and there you will find out your fortnite launcher file that is my fortnite client win64 shipping and this is the same for your valorant for your csgo for your gta5 for warzone this is same for your every single game you will find out that launcher file here now you need to right click here go for cp prd now go for current and this is right now the current settings of your task manager but guys you need to go for this all way section and simply set it on high to real time for the highest performance but real time sometimes cause bugs on low end pc so therefore i suggest you to go with high only now again right click here go for cpu affinity go for always and guys set it on none after that check mark on all these options on your all the cp cores or threads after that now go back go for input and output priority and actually the settings help you to lowering the input delay of your mouse and keyboard now you need to go for this always option and set it on normal to high but i suggest you to go with high because this work best for more users now you need to again right click on your windows star icon now go for a uh, memory priority go for always and set it on none after that now you need to go for power profile option go for it and set it on with some highest performance now once it done now again right click on your fortnite launcher now this time go for more option and there you will find out hard throttle simply go for it go for current set it on no throttle again go for always and set it on no throttle and this will help you to fixing the screen tearing and fps drops and stutters in your game so guys once you follow all these settings in your process so now you need to go for this option go for general and there you will find out your startup configuration for the process so go for it and now simply follow the same exact settings like start a login for all user start for engine as a service at the front board once you apply the settings on your pc now simply close out your startup option in the process lasso and hit yes 
after that it will ask you for restarting now for changing all this effect on your pc so hit yes this will close the process lasso and again to launch it on your pc and guys that's it now simply minimize it on your pc and this will keep running in your background whenever you turn on your pc and this will help you to getting the best performance out of your pc also so guys now here another important or bonus settings for you and that is your power throttling setting so for that press windows are together from your keyboard you will find out here this one window simply go for gp edit.msc and press enter now go for computer configuration administrative template now go for system folder and inside you will find out power management folder so go for it now go for power throttling settings turn off power throttling and now you need to enable the settings on your pc for turning off the power throttling of your gpu and your cpu then hit apply click ok and close out your local group policy editor now you need to one time reach your pc they have all the changes take effect after that run the process lesson in your background and enjoy the best performance out of your pc i hope you love it please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel and see you again in the next video